So, if we look at these maps, there are a lot of colors here. And in this video, we will look at what these different colors mean and how to interpret them. So, you'll see we've, we've got different shades of green and we've got um, uh, different shades of orange and red and, and, and so on. And the first thing you'll note when you look at to the bottom right is that we've got a color index here and it says here it's plant vigor. Now this could also mean chlorophyll activity. So so this index tells you how much chlorophyll activity is actually happening. So if it's red then the chlorophyll activity is low and if it's uh, dark green or bluish uh, then the chlorophyll activity is really high. Um, so one thing to just remember is that the size of the plants got a significant impact on the color. So the bigger your plants uh, are, the um, greener they will be, and the smaller the plants are, the redder they will be. So this is a good example. So these plants are um, a little bit older, um, as it's very clear, and that's why it's actually greener, just because there are more uh, chlorophyll activity happening in the plants. In this case, you will see, let's maybe rather use this bottom um, section here, you will see it's actually orange. It's not because they're sick or there's something wrong with it. It's just uh, it means that um, uh, they're still smaller. So maybe if we look at the clouds layer, you'll see that there's actually a little bit of green coming through. Now, this clouds layer is actually the visible spectrum layer or the RGB layer. Uh, and you will see that they've actually planted here uh, and the plants are still very small in comparison to to this field here. You will actually see that the plants are actually quite green. Um, so, and that's the reason for for these different um, color variations. Um, then if we look at the moisture layer, very similarly, uh, you will see these different variations. Um, if it's red, it means that uh, there's less uh, moisture content available, and if it's blue, it means that there are more moisture available. Um, and and that's kind of how you interpret these different colors.